Hey guys, welcome back. Today is just a random rainy summer day. So I thought I would do a little get ready with me slash maybe shop with me vlog today. It's rainy, but I just don't want to be stuck in the house. I'm not going to let a little rain stop me from shopping. So just thought I would bring you guys along today. So like I said, I'm going to get ready and then we shall go shopping. Little Maxie's right here and he's having a little snack. And I have washed my face, but I haven't moisturized yet. So I'm going to do that and I'm using the Belief the True Cream Aqua Balm, this stuff. Let's see if I can zoom you guys in. This stuff is so amazing. I absolutely love it. What I like to do is put it all over my face and then take a little bit more and pack it on the under eye area for extra moisture. It will really help. It really helps your concealer if your under eye is super dry and you get like cakiness under your eyes. What's wrong with you? Okay, so for today's foundation, I'm going to be using the NYX Total Coverage, the NYX Total Control Drop Foundation. I said I was going to review this and I had bought the wrong color, finally bought the right color and then still never reviewed it. So a mini review. I love the fact that it's matte, but it's almost too matte. Like it starts to like look a little cakey. It starts to like break up and look, I don't know, it looks really weird after a while. So I prefer to mix this in with the foundation versus just using it by itself. I think it is awesome for mixing in with the foundation. So right now I'm using the Matte and Poreless in the shade 330, which is a little too dark. So I'm going to use the shade Classic Tan 12, which is a little too light. It's super, super watery. Like, oh, look at this. Just super watery. to my NYX contour little palette and I'll be using this banana shade. I love it. I hit pan on it like literally like like it was gone. It was done and I bought a refill which is totally awesome because I love this shade. Love this powder so so much. I just bought a refill. Pop that baby in. I know my face still looks really dewy. The lights aren't helping, but that NYX Total Coverage Foundation, like, it's gonna set super matte. Like like okay, so I have been using this Maybelline Fit Me Medium Deep Powder. It's the loose finishing powder. I am so obsessed with this powder. Like I cannot even like, I don't go a day without using it now. It is my absolute go-to. I am obsessed with it. It keeps me matte, like no joke. It doesn't make me look super powdery or super cakey, especially when my natural oils start to come in. It just like absorbs the oils in such a natural way. Oh, I just, I love this powder so much, but it's so messy. So, so messy. Like right now it's like all over my vanity. Like that is the, which I mean, I'm sure I could be like less messy with it, but it's messy. <laughs> 
Okay, now that that's done, I am going to go into this little e.l.f. palette. This is the Bronzed Peach, like, Aqua Little Duo. I showed it in my um, blush declutter. <sighs> I love it so much. It was $6, affordable, amazingness, long wearing, super creamy and blendable. I just like, I can't rave about it enough. And I can't find the brush that I normally apply it with. <gasps> oh, here it is. I have been applying it with this little Maybelline contour brush. It's like their new little brush. It is amazing and I love it. You need one in your life. Like you need this little duo in your life. Okay, so I'm just going to dab in there. And it is like a cushion. It's the craziest thing, but I love it. It's very, very bronzy. It's very warm. So if you love a warm bronzer, you will love this. And to set it, I've been using the bronzers in this little Maybelline Highlight and Bronzer Kit. Love this little kit. I've been like mixing both of these here at the end. I did a first impressions over this and the Fit Me powder what maybe a month ago a few weeks ago I will link it down below but I have been using these powders or those products non-stop and I love them <laughs> I go in with MAC Format Super Deep Bronzing Blush, but today I'm feeling very coral-esque and I want to use a coral peachy blush. So I'm going to go into Milani's Coral Cove Powder Blush. Perfect. Okay. For today's highlight, I'm using the Essence Pure, 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 I don't know, the Essence Pure Nude Highlighter. Oh my goodness, Kathleen Lights raved about it, though she is like very fair compared to me. So I was like, ah, I'll give it a try, I don't know if it's really going to work for me. But it does in like the most slight glow ever, super minimal not a poppin' highlight. I've been obsessed with this. So I'm just going to take a little brush and pop it on. And it's like you almost can't even see it, but then you can. Taking over your body. It's flowing through your mind. Feelings got me on fire. Don't ever leave it all behind. Can you feel the attraction? Feel the attraction. Can you feel it between us? This energy's inside us like electricity.
that lippy. This was the Revlon Color Burst Matte Balm in Unapologetic. Love it. It's so bright. But it was making my lips like it was accentuating every line. So I'm going to take my Milani Keep It Sweet Sugar Lip Scrub and try to like exfoliate them. I love this stuff mm, and tastes good and it works so good. Okay, so we are on the road, and I just wasn't feeling that lippy, like, mm. I probably needed to exfoliate my lips, like, two more times before my lips were ready for that lippy. So, I changed to the CoverGirl Melting Pout. This is the gel liquid lipstick, and it is in the shade 105 Gelful. I am obsessed with this color. It's, it's like a nude peach color, and I love it. And here is Maxi. He loves going for rides. So we're taking him to my mom's. Right, baby? Alrighty, so we dropped off Max and we picked up the sister and it's time to grab something to eat. Ooh, all kinds of happiness. <laughs> so we're pretty starved and we're having like a late lunch. Would you consider this a late lunch? Yeah, it's almost one o'clock. We'll go get a grab we'll go grab a salad. Perhaps yeah. not. Whoa, dude, get on your lane. Okay, thank you. Okay. Okay, guys, so what do we feel like eating? Schlotzkis. Schlotzkis? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's alright. Okay. <laughs>
oh my goodness, little jackpot. Look at this. It's Ray Dunn. Oh my gosh. And the bowls. Like, number one, I'm obsessed with pineapples, flamingos, but Ray Dunn. Yes, please. I found Okay, so this is a bathing suit. One of my cousins had this and I was like, oh my gosh, where did you get it? And she said she got it at Marshall's, but like a long time ago. So I had like given up hope. I found one at Francesca's, a black one, and I bought it, but oh my goodness. Like now I have it in white and I'm so excited. <laughs> a little too excited. I'm so excited. So cute. So this little one piece off the shoulder is $19.99. That is a steal. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. One that's not chipped. Okay, are you gonna get a uh, pineapple one? Uh huh. Okay. That one's chipped. That one's chipped. Check it. Uh, this one looks good. You should get this one. Okay, yeah, put it in the bag. And more Ray done. Yes, please. I already have an out of the office. I'm going to get a beach. So let's get this one. Oh my gosh, look at that inside. It's beautiful. These are $4.99. I'm gonna grab one for me. I'm gonna grab one for the sister. And I'm gonna grab one for a friend. These are so cute. I love it, but I'm really looking for a ray done little canister but this is so cute it's only $7.99 I love it oh and these little teapots love it oh my goodness these are adorable they are so cute and vibrant they're only $2.99 oh my goodness I love these even just to get one to like put my straws in so cute. They even have like the frosted glass, but I don't think those are as cute. Oh my gosh, that little bitty trash can. That's so cute. It's teeny tiny. It's $3.99 and they sell these not as small. But they have the smaller ones at the DT for a dollar. Oh, that little watermelon LED sign is so cute. Oh my goodness, look at how adorable this is. Oops. But first mascara that is so bright and beautiful i love it Energies inside us like electricity. Feel the love running 
Are you taking me to uh, Michael's? Yep. Perfect. Okay. Got a lot of good stuff at Marshall's and it's time for a little snack. So we brought our little Schlotzky's chips that we didn't eat. We always got to have a snack on hand. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And um, I have my little Starbucks cup. I am obsessed. <clears throat> oh my goodness. <coughs> Them jalapeno <laughs> chips got me. <laughs> so before I was choking, I was gonna tell you about my little cup. Mark brought this in for me one day because I had seen it and I was like, oh my gosh, that's so pretty. And then my hubby got me a little surprise. And I love it. Number one, I'm obsessed with this. Whoop. <laughs> I'm obsessed with this Tiffany blue color. And I posted it on Snapchat when he got it for me and a lot of you were asking me what color it was because when you looked at it online it was saying like aqua and it looked lighter online but I'm pretty sure it's the same. There's not like a, it doesn't have a color name on it. I'm obsessed with it. The inside is like insulated, right? Or like it's like one of those cups that keeps your drink cold really long. Ice is still in it from early, early this morning. But now we are on the way to Michael's. And I'm looking for the silhouette sketch pins. I'm working on some invites. And I was using a white sketch pen. And it ran out. Like, literally, like, 12, 13 invitations. And it's already out of ink. Like, that's kind of annoying. Because I think it's like a pack of three for ten dollars. Um, I did see a DIY on how to like make your own little sketch pens, but you have to like find these certain little markers. So I'm going to try to do that, but I really need to get these invites done like now. So our Michaels didn't have the sketch pen, like the little set with the white, which is what I need. So hopefully makers will you turn. Fingers crossed. And I'm here, and they don't have the pin that I need. Oh my goodness. Oh, but look at this. It's a pin holder. Oh my gosh, this is probably even better. This is worth a shot. 